Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. When the Union gunboat, the USS Essex, shelled the city of Natchez on September 2, 1862, a young girl named Rosalie Beekman was struck by shrapnel. Rosalie was the seven-year-old daughter of Fanny and Aaron Beekman, who had immigrated to the United States from Bavaria. Aaron Beekman operated a business on Silver Street at Natchez under the hill, across the river from where the Essex had landed. As the shelling began, the Beekmans attempted to escape from the scene with their six children. As the family ran up Silver Street, little Rosalie was knocked down. When her father called for her to get up and run, she replied, I can't, Papa, I'm killed. Rosalie died the following day, on this day, September 3rd, in 1862, becoming Natchez's only civilian casualty during the war. She is buried in the Jewish section of the Natchez City Cemetery. Rosalie Beekman has been portrayed during Angels on the Bluff, an annual fundraiser for the Natchez City Cemetery, during which Natchezians reenact the lives of those interred there. I'm Bea Burns. I'm a lifelong resident of Natchez and I'm a certified tour guide for the city and this has been a Natchez History Minute.